Hi guys, today we're going to look at how to animate a still photo with a parallax motion effect in Photoshop. In this example, I am using a photo of me in the Grand Canyon in Arizona. So let's get started. Open a photo you want to work with, right click and click on duplicate layer. So now you have two layers. Go ahead and rename the sky layer and go and hide it. Then now click on the background layer and click on the quick selection tool. Set your brush to the following, size 10 pixels, hardness 100% and spacing 1% and go ahead and highlight the sky layer. Next just go ahead and delete it and then press Ctrl D to deselect. Go ahead and click on the sky layer to activate it. Then go ahead and click on the lasso tool and just go ahead and highlight the remaining of the background of the image. So excluding the sky layer this time. You can go ahead and just drag outside of the border to ensure all of the background is selected. Next, click on edit and fill. Choose content aware and click OK. Next in the layers panel, go ahead and right click on both layers and convert to smart object. Next click on the background layer and click on edit transform or the shortcut is Control T. Then go ahead and just enlarge it so it's a little bigger than the actual frame size itself. Let's set it in motion, so go ahead and select Window, Timeline, then click on Create Video Timeline. Go ahead and expand the background copy, and let's click on the Transform to create a keyframe. Move the playhead to the end of the timeline. We want to scale the building back to its original size, so go ahead and click on the Move button, and then click on Ctrl T to resize the image back to its original size. Then hit enter. This automatically creates a keyframe. So go ahead and move the playhead back to the beginning and now we will work on the sky layer. Expand the sky layer and click on transform to create a new keyframe. Then move the playhead to the end of the timeline and this time go ahead and click on the clouds and move it directly up. So that's it. You can go ahead and click on the play button now to go ahead and preview the effect. Note that it is moving slowly at this stage because it hasn't been rendered. Let's export this. So go ahead and click on the three line button then click on render video. You can go ahead and rename this now. Select a folder. You can choose a format. Okay, so I have changed this to H.264 and also high quality and also for the size, I've also chosen HD 1080p. Then click on render. So now your video is just exporting. Locate the MP4 file on your computer and go ahead and open it to preview what you've just created. And there we go. So just like that, that's how you can animate a still photo using the parallax motion effect in Photoshop. Thanks for watching. See ya.